Codex means, and I'm going to sum this up in like another, a few other slides too. It's kind of, we'll summarize this, but this means that all hosting is community owned and shares revenue with the users. Okay. This is decentralized hosting. Right now, Block Fabric is not decentralized. Most hosting companies are not decentralized and owned by a community. Okay. But Block Fabric is going to be acquired by, so Codex is acquiring Block Fabric. And what they're going to do is, um, let's stay back on that one, Stephen, for a minute on Block Fabric. All of the revenue that comes through for hosting is going to be used, number one, to build up hosting resources by servers and that kind of stuff, and also be distributed throughout the community members, similar to kind of how the Win blockchain works. So if you guys know, if you own a Win smart node and you're running it, you get access to the distribution of the revenue that runs through the through the Connect shopping cart, and it go, it's only gets paid out. It's the node owners who get it. It all goes through the Win blockchain. Connect actually never pays anybody. It all just runs through you know the Win blockchain distribution. Um, Codex wants to share the revenue with the users, and so that's it's an opportunity to take an ownership in hosting, a real decentralized hosting, and then um, share in the revenue and also receive Codex rewards for running a Codex node. Okay, this is super awesome, super exciting. Um, the next one, Stephen, this sums it up. These are kind of like the three points of the of Codex. Okay, number one, own your hosting. All in favor of being owners of decentralized hosting, I, you know what I mean? Like owned by the community. The next one is own your data. So when you go to a third party, like a centralized hosting group, anyone, if you go to Volta or you go to other ones, whatever, and you start giving out your usernames and passwords to people and and they get your information, you don't own your data anymore. They're going to start trying to sell you other things. They're, they can communicate whatever it is. And so with Codex, you'll be able to own your own data. Okay. You're not giving up your login credentials to random people. You're not, uh, you're actually an owner of the thing and, um, and, and it's yours, right? And then you also get a share in the revenue. And so Codex hosting is amazing. There's a promotion right now, I think it's on the next slide, which is if you buy a Codex node um, for each one, it includes 30 months of hosting for 10 nodes. Okay, so that, that means if you, have not, if you have nine nodes and you buy a Codex node, now you have 10 you would have free hosting for all of those nodes for 30 months. Um, the code right now, and so, um, and I was going to say this about the Foundations AI, it's probably quite helpful to say, um, you don't need to run those nodes yet because they're not, they're not live. Um, and so once you start running them, you'll need to run them right now. You do not need to, uh, to do that. And then um, they're going to figure out, as they do the acquisition of Block Fabric, they'll figure out the timing between uh, once you can start using your 30 months of hosting on those uh, for those uh, certificates. So um, I don't know what you mean exactly. Sorry, I just haven't been glancing at the comments, but I'm coming over. Um, interesting, kind of like vertical integration. Well, I, I would say vertical. it's actually decentralized integration because it's it's really what's going to happen is, is all the node owners are going to own the hardware. They're going to own the revenue. They're going to own their own hosting. They're going to own their own data. And so it's, it's actually um, really cool. Um, can we host other nodes on Codex? Any brand. Um, so what happens is it's kind of like Block Fabric, where you can host um, any node that you want. Um, you'll be able to host any node on on Codex. So I'm just saying a Codex node will also need to be hosted. Um, and so that is that. Uh, perfect. Good questions. Okay. Um, this is a promotion that's happening with Foundations AI and Codex Smart Nodes right now for salespeople. So if you're selling and sharing. For every Foundations AI node you sell, or for every Codex Smart node you sell, you can get, but you can do sell one get one for up to ten per week, and so that's the promotion of a sell one get one that also ends on twelve eleven. So huge, um, huge opportunity for this. Um, the uh, the sell one get one. So if you get one, let's stay back there for just one sec, Stephen. You don't also get the hosting, and you don't also get the the boost NFTs with the Foundations AI. Um, you get you actually receive the node. Um, the person who purchases is the one who gets the boost NFTs and on Foundations AI, and the person who purchases is the one who gets the 30, 30 months for ten nodes um, with Codex. So that's what's happening. Um, and so Jimmy just uh, asked, that's a really good question. Can we sell ten um, of each of these? Uh, yes, you can, Jimmy. We so have... up to ten nodes per week. We had another good question come in just for clarification. Those that attended Las Vegas, 
earned uh, foundation codex and elevate nodes for just attending that yep. does not include the bundle is that correct it's just yeah the license? It, it return yeah it inclu includes the nodes um it doesn't include the other the other things yep so you can go uh, out and purchase the additional nfts um to be able to include that in just in yeah. so if you want to get going on that that's something that you can do just by pairing that with your codex ones that you earned in las vegas yeah. Um, is Codex as easy as Block Fabric? Well, I think it'll probably end up being easier, Melanie. Yeah. So it's a it, it should be an easy button for sure. Um, let's see. Uh, so let's see. Thanks for clarifying. Codex node. Um, yeah, you can hold a you can host a Codex node on on Codex. Yes. Um, you don't need to you don't need to host it with Codex. Um, I would own I if I were an owner of Codex. I would hope like, and had nodes and like all that kind of stuff. I would host everything with Codex. I'd want to share in the revenue with the community and I would want to earn Codex rewards um, and support my, the I, I like to support the things I own. Like I don't want to use Coinbase to buy crypto. I want to use Switch. I don't want to, use, you know what I mean? Like I don't want a, another health app. I want Galvin. Like I, I want to support like the projects and, and all that kind of stuff that I have nodes in. So that's my personal opinion. Um, uh, but, uh, so Pam pricing will, what, so they'll, they'll see pricing right now. The, they're, they haven't acquired block fabric, so nothing's changed on the pricing. Um, and so we'll find out what the pricing is. And then also when you look at the rev, I guess there's probably a revenue share consideration in the price. Cause if you're hosting there and receiving revenue share, like maybe, hopefully maybe hosting could become free one day. So that would be amazing. Um, okay.